I've no idea where to start. The stakes are high. What is up everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm at Miller and Carter in Worcester taking on the undefeated Butcher's Block. The guys here have informed me that this has never been completed by a single person ever. And so today for safe measure, I've ordered two. So in front of me here, I have the ultimate steak sharing experience called the Butcher's Block. We have two of these, which include ribeye 10 ounce, rump 7 ounce, two cuts of fillet at five ounces each, served with beef brisket topped with bone marrow. On the side, we have fries with each, a lettuce wedge, all of the sauces, and the onion loaf and all of the garnishes. The aim of the game is to get this down as quickly and cleanly as I possibly can. If I manage to do that, I will be successful today. However, if I fail, I'll be thoroughly disappointed and I think everybody in this room will be disappointed too. If you enjoyed this video, guys, give it a thumbs up. Comment down below if you have anything else to add. If you haven't yet subscribed or followed, do consider doing so before you leave. This is the ultimate sharing experience at Miller and Carter, the butcher's block times two. Let's get into it. Where do I start? Steak, right? Steak, steak, steak. We're, we're steak sharing experience. Starting with the steak. In three, two, one, let's go. No, no, tomato. Delicious. Onion loaf. Good day steak lovers and welcome back to the channel where we often go when no other foodies have been bold enough to have gone before and all in the name of food challenges. Bone marrow has a special place in my heart. Mm. That is just... Oh, yum. and it has this like lovely pulled brisket. Whilst I bask in the delight of the bone marrow, let's talk about why I'm here. Now the lovely people at Miller and Carter reached out and said, nobody has ever completed our butcher's block and we think it's impossible. And to that I said, that's interesting, I'll take two. To be fair, it's been a hot minute since I've had a fillet steak. ribeye though. Ribeye in the peppercorn, now that would be my order. For those of you unfamiliar, Miller and Carter is the home of the ultimate steak experiences and definitely a favourite of mine. So as you can imagine, as soon as they reached out and set the challenge, my answer was immediately yes. This is a rum steak, all cooked medium rare because I'm not a heathen. I was guessing these fries are going to be the hardest to get through. <laughs> I think you're like a, a safe distance away from me. <laughs> Because this is, oh, I just don't know how to. This is where I stitch myself up ordering there. I always feel really harsh on rum steak, so I'm really, I'm just not a fan of the cut, but 
still very well cooked here. Two of these butcher's blocks include the following. 16 ounces, 50 day aged black Angus ribeye. 16 ounces, 30 day aged rump. 10 ounces black Angus fillet steaks. Two brisket stuffed marrow bones. Four seasoned fries. Four onion loaves. And for good measure, four lettuce wedges with dressing. And also, if you've not been to Miller and Carter before, that onion loaf is the greatest thing to have ever graced a butcher's block. I'm getting nods from the chef, I think that's a good sign. Doing well. can all come closer, you know. It's like spitting distance. <laughs> I was trying to work out why the tension's so high, but obviously there's sweepstakes going on, so everyone's like, hurry up and eat. Not me literally biting off more than I can chew. That was a big, big chunk of meat. Big. And as I dig into Marrowbone number two, let's talk about understand. the game itself. The aim of this game is to finish within 30 minutes to be successful. This is an unofficial challenge, but if you fancy your chances against the butcher's block, I'll leave links to Miller and Carter below. And if you do end up paying a visit to the Worcester branch, let them know that the shuts sent you. Thank you all so much for your attention. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Let me know below what types of challenges you would like to see next. And I'll catch you guys on the next one. Steaks. Okay, we're 12 minutes in. I need to get these down, <laughs> reluctantly. You all look surprised. <laughs> it could be surprise, it could be shock and horror. A mixture of all three, maybe. It's just so delicious. I'm having a lovely time. I'm thoroughly enjoying my steak experience. My, my sharing, the only share that I know is the singer. Would I have eaten a whole lettuce head? A lovely meal going on here. Just a nice lunch. Look at this. Look at this, eh? Look at us. eating fillets like a cannibal. 
Mm-mm-mm. last 10 ounce steak left everyone so that was the undefeated butcher's block times two complete in just under 25 minutes that means that today we are successful and i'm over the moon this is my ideal meal and probably one of the greatest challenges in my mind that there ever could be so if you'd like to check out miller and carter in worcester i'm going to leave links to them down below in the description if you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up comment down below if you have anything else to add and if you haven't yet subscribed or followed do consider doing so before you leave thank you all so much for watching I had a lovely time today and i'll catch you guys on the next one The guys here have said, if I manage to do it, generally they would be impressed. So the stakes are high. But I'm dumb. No? Okay. I can't believe you all doubted me so much.